Welcome to the best channel to connect with the celebrity world on a daily basis. If this is your first time here with us, don't miss this opportunity to subscribe and give us a like, as your presence is very important to us. And if you're already a subscriber, don't forget to turn on notifications so you don't miss any updates. Let's satisfy your curiosity about the latest news, so come with me now. A preliminary investigation determined that a 33-year-old man was involved in a domestic dispute with a 30-year-old woman, the New York Police Department said in a statement to Variety on Saturday. The victim reported to the police that she was assaulted. The police took the 33-year-old man into custody without incident. The victim suffered minor injuries to her head and neck and was taken to a nearby hospital in stable condition. The NYPD report, which identified Majors, 33, as the alleged assailant listed several potential charges, including strangulation, assault, and harassment based on the woman's injuries and her account of the alleged incident. After the police took the Creed Three star into custody, the actor's representative vehemently denied all claims. He did nothing wrong, a major spokesperson told CNN in a statement on Saturday. We look forward to clearing his name and resolving this. Before we continue, we would like to thank you for being here and remind you that it is very important for us that you give this video a like so we can continue to bring you the latest news from the world of celebrities daily. Thank you in advance. Now, let's continue with this news that is causing a stir. The Texas native rose to fame in 2017, starring as Ken Jones in ABC's limited series When We Rise. Since then, Majors has landed roles in Lovecraft Country, The Trial of the Chicago Seven, The Power of the Dog, Defied Bloods, and Devotion. Majors later made his debut in the Marvel Cinematic Universe in 2021 with his portrayal of Khan the Conqueror in the first season of Disney Plus S. Loki. Since then, he has starred in Paul Rudd's Ant-Man and the Wasp, Quantumania, which was released earlier this year, and is slated to reprise his role in future Marvel projects. What a bombshell news! What is your opinion about it? Share in the comments, as we value your participation here on the channel. Big hug and see you on the next update!